guys welcome back to pokemon adventures episode six hope you guys are super excited to be back today guys if you don't know already this is pokemon adventures based off of the manga pokemon adventures it's pretty fun having a lot of fun if you haven't checked out the last few episodes be sure to give them a whirl uh, in our last episode we made our way through mount moon uh with misty and counter team rocket and uh, now we're heading uh to cerulean city uh, so, Misty, we sent her on... Oh, that was a weird sound. Uh, we sent Misty on her way. Oh, what's over here to cut? Uh, yeah, it does look like it can be cut down. Uh, so heading into Cerulean City, following the main, uh, the plot of, of this game. Oh, you seem to be... Hi there. My wife passed away a while ago. We never had any kids, but I always knew she wanted one. She trusted these abandoned sparrow like her treated, not trusted, like her own children. When she was alive, she would constantly ask me whether we could adopt them. I said no. I, I said no. I, I should have said yes. But now she's gone. I'm sorry, buddy. That's, that's, that's heavy. That's some heavy stuff, my dude. I'm sorry. But anyway, Cerulean City. It's raining. That's fun. Huh. Phew! We're finally here at Cerulean City. Alright, uh, I'm gonna go ahead, uh, meet me at my place. Uh, see you later! At your place? Uh, well, wait, I... I don't know where your house is! I'm sure it's the, the smallest one. A mysterious blue aura surrounds it. Is it, is it rain? Is that the mysterious aura? Hey, can I talk to you? Water type is strong against fire type. But they are weak against electric type. I know this because I'm smart. Duh. Uh, I would like to go heal up. Also, let's, uh, for those of you who have not seen it, uh, this is my party right here. We got it over on that side over there. We got our level 27 Par Poliwhirl, our level 16 Bulbasaur, and our level 20 Pink. Uh, Bulbasaur is, uh, is not doing uh, the best. He needs to get some levels. Uh, me? I I'm so brave. You, you know what? You know what? We did, right? Guess. I, I, I don't I don't I don't know don't you think water type Pokemon is the coolest I'm gonna say yes because you're in Cerulean City I like your style take this TM show the world how awesome water type are what is a uh, TM 18 I'm gonna lie to you because I know better uh, TM case uh, TM 18 is rain dance uh, a worthless move that I'm sure people use I just I I and I don't like like area uh, not area. You know what I mean. Like, uh, battle place affecting moves. I really miss my friend. I wish I had told her how I really felt about her before she passed away. Dude, what is up with everyone dying in Cerulean City? Cerulean City, the town of sadness. Is this Misty's house? It's the only one with a mailbox? No. It's a Pokemon with a particular ability moves faster than rain. By manipulating the weather, you may end up turning a slow Pokemon into a fast one. Well, cool. Uh, water residents. Water? What are you talking about? Um, hi? Uh, what the heck was that? That's, I'm asking the same question, Red. Slay, slay! Hi, uh, person who can transport me all over the world. Uh, I would. I don't know why I'm healing. I'm healing out of just assumption. Also, you guys are blocking the map, so I feel like I should talk to you. Whoa, that's a cool Digimon. I'll trade you my precious Numeron for that. Uh, War Greymon. No way. War Greymon is not up for trading. That's fair. I wouldn't trade War Greymon. Dude, I would love a, a new Digimon game to come out. Digimon was. That's where we came from. Digimon was was real cool. I'm not gonna lie, Digimon was uh, was interesting. You guys are fighting to keep me from going that way. Why are you trying to say you don't want to be with me anymore? <sighs> Getting back with Lewis Marsh. Uh, why? I'm sorry, babe. Her parents just got a new pool. Hey, that's fair. That's fair. Dung to go, dislike smoke. Uh, what the what? Hey, you're telling me. All right, we're looking for is is uh, what is this random house right here? So oh, this is really in bike shop. Uh, let's go inside and see if it. I, I want to buy a bike, but it's so expensive. Mm, <laughs> buy a bike! <laughs> the chicks dig it! <laughs> I'm sure the chicks do. 
Uh, still looking for Misty's house, though. Maybe we didn't come from this way. Oh, no, we didn't. We came from the other way down. Uh, random cave right there. Is there anything up here? Bunch of slow poke. Cool. I'm just gonna turn around and walk away from them. I like how it's only raining once you get to Cerulean City. Is Misty's house down? I still got things to do in the city. Yeah, but I went into all three of those houses. None of those are Misty's house. Went to the bike shop. Oh, did I just not go up? I just didn't go up because there's Misty over there. Uh, people actually think the Cerulean City's gym leader has three other sisters. People, huh? People think that, huh? Have they ever asked her? I mean, she's got the largest house here. Hi there. I'm planning to turn Cerulean City into a water theme park. <laughs> it's a good idea, right? Dude, I would love to go to a water theme park. Hi, Misty. <laughs> what took you so long? Look at me now. I'm all wet. Um, poor choice. So words? But what do you mean by what took me so long? This is my first time here. You shouldn't have run off. <sighs> Come on, let's get out of this storm. You can stay over at my place for today. Uh, this house is, is huge. It's, it's not really your house, is it? <laughs> sure is. Uh, Lady Misty, the guest room is ready for your friend. Thank you. Uh, Lady Misty, your food is also ready for you and your guest. All right, thank you. Come on, Red, let's eat. A few moments later. <laughs> so then I had to fight all these Team Rocket Strut all by myself while Misty had her beauty nap. <laughs> it only took me a couple minutes to kick all their butts. Misty, why aren't you sitting with us? Listen up, Red. I need to talk to you. What? What do you want to talk about? Like about how I kicked everyone's butt while you were asleep? Shut up! When our Pokemon are fully rested, we should do some serious training. What? Oh, training! Yeah, those guys we fought back in Mount Moon were most likely low-ranking mooks. I don't know what mooks is. This means our future opponents will be even stronger. Huh. Well, don't get your underwear in a knot. What? Why would I put my underwear in a knot? That wouldn't be comfortable. People like them might scare you. <laughs> but I can pound them easily. So you want to get hurt again? You got hurt? If you had seen me in battle, you wouldn't be saying that. Idiot! Yeah, you don't have to take it personally. This is the best guest room we have. Sorry that it's a bit messy. If we were expecting Lady Misty to bring home company, we would have tidied up this room. <laughs> nah, this is great. Thank you. Good night. Why? 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 Why do I have... Why can I not see? Just some random books about water type. Why can't I see? Should I go to sleep? No. Can I leave the room, actually? I should head off to bed. Oh, well... Then don't give me the, the ability to not go to bed. Huh? What was that? Oh, hi, Starmie. Huh? Ugh. What is that? I can't see clearly in the dark. Ah, it's coming! Big oof. Bald Starmie appeared. Go Poliwhirl. Uh, actually, don't go Poliwhirl. Go Pika. Oh, Pika, you almost died. Outspeed, please. Transform into a normal type? Well, that sucked. Oh, a quick attack. Nope, did not do enough. We sh definitely should have went for another Thunderbolt. Because he's going to kill me here. Unless we crit. Nope. And do the Bubble Beam. Boy, boy. Alright, so he... Starry switched to a normal type. So, type advantages don't really matter here. But we are going to go for a Razor Leaf. We've already camouflaged. You can't really camouflage again. Bubble Beam shouldn't do too much effective. Camouflage again. No, I really wanted you to camouflage again. Uh... He can just do a couple more stupid moves. Nope, that's swift. All right, bring in, bring in the big gun. I'll just try and get other people XP. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. Just punch him in the face. Why do you keep trying to use camouflage when you're already camouflaged? Huh, huh, where'd it go? It's it's gone. The next day. Uh, somebody after me? If so, that Pokemon from last night sure was powerful. <laughs> Cerulean City must be full of strong trainers. Excuse me, sir. Do you need any help? <laughs> yes, uh, who's the gym leader of Cerulean City? I'm gonna go kick his butt. <laughs> ah! <laughs> hey, what's so funny? I mean, I can defeat him, Who you know, whoever he is. <laughs> so you want to fight the Cerulean gym leader, huh? You can find the gym in the Cerulean City. You can 
Find the gym leader. It's really city gym now. All right, cool. Let's go uh, do that. Uh, we are going to go heal up, though, because I assume now all of our Pokemon are just real dead. There they are. So let's go heal up real fast. And then we'll go take on the Cerulean City Gym. I wonder who it could be. It, it really could be anyone. I'm going to be so surprised. I'm, I'm sure it's going to be some random uh, person we've never met before. You know. Uh, hey, are, are you the gym leader? I obviously can't tell from this direction who you are. Hey, answer me, you jerk. Are you the gym leader? Huh? Misty? <laughs> Funny joke. Honestly, Misty? Uh, where's the gym leader? Ah! Wait a minute. Oh, what are you doing? Not in the mood to fight. Well, maybe you'll start fighting if I tell you that I was the one who attacked you last night. That was you? Fine, you'll regret it, Misty. Razor Leaf. Huh, <laughs> Bubble Beam. Now what are you going to do, Red? Ugh! Misty, why all of a sudden are you... <laughs> I thought you knew how I felt about us being a team. I just defeated you with Starmie alone, but Starmie wasn't strong enough back in Mount Moon. Don't you see? If we don't get stronger, they'll destroy us. We have to be as strong as possible. We have to use teamwork! <laughs> she did all that so I would understand. <coughs> Okay, I'll fight Team Rocket with you. But you gotta stop crying. <laughs> Alright then, go heal your Pokemon and then come back. Time for some serious training. I just healed my Pokemon though. Misty, I, I, I literally just healed them. Also, I totally could have defeated you. Because of type advantages. <clears throat> also, before we walk in here... Oh, not my Pokedex. I am actually gonna switch uh, Pika into first. Because we are about to battle her. Oh crap, we gotta actually battle our way to them. May need to stop. Lady Misty has asked me to fight you. If you wish to train with Misty, you need to piss fast me first. Prepare yourself. I assume it's just gonna be water types, hopefully. Golden, yeah. So this will be some good training for Pika. Some good XP. Super effective. Huff, huff, that's enough. You shall pass. <laughs> uh, it's a cool little Pokeball. Uh, pool you got here, though, like a little lazy river. You defeated Nita, that's impressive, but now it's my turn. I won't go down easy. Yeah, that's fair. I wouldn't ask you to. Oh, you got a Gyarados? That's cool. Hopefully I still one-shot you. Yeah, still one-shot you. Yeah. Nice 1,000 XP there. Uh, no... Yes. You're a tell it. <clears throat> Psyduck, uh, no. Uh, this is Pikachu's time to get some XP here. I probably should be using Bulbasaur as well right here. Because Bulbasaur would also probably get some easy XP off this. He's up to level 22 now. <laughs> so you, you passed the test. <laughs> uh, I actually will switch Bulba up. And, uh... Lady Misty is up ahead, but as Lady Misty's guards, I'll be testing you to see whether you're worth the time. Now show me what you've got, Red. You're her guards? I thought you were a maid. Alright, Poliwag, cool. Hit him with a rain dance. Hey, that's perfect. That that only will help me. Super effective. Hit him with a body slam. Did some decent damage. Super effective. 300 XP. Ball through the level 17. Coming in with a side duck. I will not change Pokemon. Uh, hit him with a razor leaf confusion. I was really hoping I could tank at least one hit, so then I could swap out. That was what the hope was there. Uh, horsey, no, we'll leave Pika in because Pika needs to get speed. There we go. I'm just gonna one shot. I'm actually not even gonna go heal up. Oh, how come you're so powerful? How? How come? <laughs> well done, you've defeated all three of my guards. Now it's time for your final training. Pretend I'm Team Rocket and fight me. Don't hold back this time. I'm just gonna use my type advantages. Uh, Star you. Uh, we outspeed here. One shot. Bring in Star Me for me. Nope, don't want to change. You're going to go ahead and get that uh, second shot. There we go, Misty. That's all it takes. Sorry. <laughs> well, you, your training's complete, is it? I feel like we didn't do anything. <laughs> you are ready now, Red. Now let's fight to save the Pokemon from Team Rocket. Take this Cascade Badge. It makes Pokemon up to level 30 obey you. 
I got the Cascade Badge. Huh. Remember to always keep trading, Red. We have to be strong so no other innocent Pokemon will go through what my poor Gyarados went through. Good luck in your journey. I won't forget. See you, Misty. End of the Cascade bad. That just, it, it always cleans itself up so nicely. Let me jump in right here uh, to the manga to uh, to show you guys how this went down in the manga. It's pretty exciting uh, after getting out of, of uh, Mount Moon. Very similar uh, Lee, they went and traveled to, uh, suddenly Starmie, uh, made their way to Misty's residence, which is actually right there. Huge house. Red being like, whoa, this is a huge place. Misty gets all dolled up by her maids. Uh, Red is still just like, what are you on about? And then right there, just as he did in this episode, uh, spends time talking to the maids, telling them how he's so much more amazing. Uh, before, of course, going to bed. Once he's in bed, he does get attacked uh, by a Starmie, uh, asks for help, uh, and just completely gets the entire room destroyed there. Uh, the next day, of course, uh, they're talking about it again. Uh, he goes, all the maids laughing, just like they didn't hear uh, about all that. And he's like, the gym leader, he's right here. Fights Misty the same way, and they kind of train. Uh, he wins, but afterwards, uh, it, 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 it talks about Bill. So it looks like in our next episode, we may be dealing with Bill and finding out about his Pokemonic ways. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, let me know in the comment section down below. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe button. And be sure to come back next week for the next episode of Pokemon Adventures. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.